learning, you know, when they were sophomores and juniors and kind of having to be humble, I guess, and, and not get as much playing time as, as they wanted. They worked really hard. We're best friends. We hang out all the time. If we're not at practice, we're either at our friend Larry's house or at someone's house, just bonding. Our chemistry, I think, is one of the best in the state. And, um, you know, at any given night, like, one of these guys can go off. <laughs> We believe that we could do uh, whatever we wanted at the beginning of the year. We still believe that, so that's all that really matters is we believe in ourselves. I definitely had confidence in our team because everyone counted us out. They didn't think we'd be good. All my friends from other schools thought we'd be awful. The Wolves have already eclipsed their single season win total dating back to 2013-2014 and have also drawn inspiration from the Chandler football program and former head coach Sean Iguano. He's just the guy that built something, you know, from, from the ground up. He put in the hours, and, and I think the biggest takeaway that I've taken from him is he's great with kids, and he's always honest. How they work, how they prepare for every game, and uh, just like the winning mentality that they have, he tries to bring it on to us. My junior, sophomore, and freshman year, the, whenever the basketball team had stuff going on, it didn't really matter. The only thing that was really emphasized was football. And then now, like now today, everyone's just talking about the basketball team now. It feels good. They're hungry and they take every night, you know, serious and, and they really want to play for one another.